Hi everyone and welcome. In today's video, I'm going to show you how to create a modern scroll to top navigation with custom animation shapes and style using WordPress floating awesome button plugin. Okay, so without any further ado, let's get started. Okay, so firstly, you need to make sure that you already installed floating awesome button plugin. Uh, you can find it from a WordPress plugin directory or you can find the link in the descriptions below where you can download the plugin and also install it into your website. Okay, pretty cool. All right. So firstly, we need to create a scroll to top actions button. Okay, um, to do that, go to FAB and click add new and then type in the title scroll to top just like that. And then after that, you need to change the setting for the actions button into a scroll to top uh, type. Okay, just like that. And then we are going to assign a shortcut or hotkey as a control plus return. I'm going to show it to you later for uh, why we want to uh, put a shortcut key for the actions button. Okay. And now we are going to change the icon. We are going to change it to Chevron's app, just like that. You can go to uh, for an awesome website to see the reference of the icon. Uh, there's a 7,000 plus icon that you can pick from uh, for the actions button. All right, just like that. And yep, I think that's all. Now hit publish and when we go to the front ends right now scroll down a little bit there you go so here is your scroll to top actions buttons that's is how easy it is to actually create a scroll to top uh, uh, button with a floating awesome button plugin uh, if you notice that there you go there is a little bit there's a, an animations in just like that and out animations just like that uh, as a, in the default setting uh, the buttons is actually using rotate in and rotate out animations to change the button animations you need to go to the setting and click floating awesome button okay and then go to the module and then you can find it right here there's a bunch of setting that you can play around okay all right, so um, you can change the set. You can set the uh, offset of the button. You can change the durations and uh, and so on. Uh, but for now, I'm going to change uh, the in and in and out animations. Okay, as I told you, as uh, the the in animations is a rotate in, and the out animations is a rotate out. I'm going to change it into bounce in up animations for the in animations and for the out animation I'm going to change it to bounce out down animation just like that and hit save okay after that you can go back to the front end to see it in actions there you go you can scroll it again and there you go that's how easy it is to actually change the animation you can pick from 25 plus animations uh, that it that can be applied into the scroll to top buttons okay um, if you go to here uh, to the settings page there's a, a link right here uh, uh, that will lead you into animate.css page where you can play around uh, with the animations uh, which uh, animation that you would like to actually um, apply into your button just like that okay um, okay also, as I mentioned before in the beginning of the video, uh, I'm going to not only the animations, but we are going to change the shapes of the button. To do that, again, go to setting and go to floating awesome button and go to the design section. Then you will find there is a template sections right here, right? Now, just change it into shape and we are going to change the shape into what about pentagon just like that okay there's a uh, links also right here so where you can play around and pick whichever a uh, shape uh, that you'd like to for your uh, scroll to top uh, actions button okay cool now hit save 
Okay, now let's go back to the front end. And now when we scroll down, there you go. The button has changed its shape into a pentagon, right? Okay, again, there's a 10 plus shapes that you can pick from uh, currently supported in the floating awesome button plugin. Okay, so we have just changed the shape just like that. Now we are going to change the uh, styles of the button. We are going to change the button's colors. You can change uh, the button color by using a default uh, menus right here, or you can go to the FAB uh, and change the uh, button colors just like this, okay? All right, so maybe what about red? And also I would like to change the um, icon into black, just like that. Now hit update, right? When we refresh the page now and scroll down and voila, just like that. The color, uh, the background color has been changed to red and the icon color also has been changed to black. You can play around and change a different setting that uh, which will match your website design and stuff. Um, um, yep, just like that. That's actually how easy it is to actually create an actions button. Well, well, this is some bonuses right here. All of the setting that I already mentioned be, uh, before, it is actually completely free. You can set everything is up right here. It's for completely free, but there's a one, um, one uh, premium features right here. It's called hotkey. All right, just like this one. Control. We have set uh, the hotkey before it uh, as a control plus return. Right. So imagine right. So you are readers right here, and then you scroll down. You can click that, click the button, or you can use a shortcut key, control plus return to actually execute a scroll to top um, actions button. How awesome is that, right? So say you have a very, very large website and stuff and you kind of very lazy to click that button. You can just use the hard key control plus enter control plus return to actually execute the actions button. And also I'm going to uh, show it to you now. If you uh, just like this, if you resize the screen into a mobile screen, scroll down and voila there you go this is how is it going to be looks like in the mobile screen pretty cool right just like that and there you go pretty cool right bunching up animations and bunch out down animations that's it for the video and thanks for watching if you like it please don't forget to subscribe likes and comments also if you have any trouble issues and needs to create a custom wordpress plugin that can help your business to excel and perform check out our wordpress development agencies at artistudio xyz we offer affordable daily and monthly development service that fits your business needs great see you in the next video